Hi and welcome to Easy Fishing. Uh, with this episode I want to run through how to set up two heavier river floats, namely an Avon float and the loafer. Both are used in faster flowing water. The Avon you would probably use in deep water and the Chubba is for use in shallow, fast flowing water. So, we'll do the Avon first. You need three float rubbers. I've pre-cut them to save time. So we'll thread the top float rubber on the line first, which is the largest diameter, obviously, because it's going over the tip. Wet the tip of the float. Slide it down till it touches the shoulder. Take the next piece of silicone, which is for the, a different diameter for the stem. Slide that on the line. Wet the float stem. Slide it up to about halfway or thereabouts. And then you take your final piece, which is smaller in diameter. Put it on the line. And thread that over the base of the float. So it looks like that. The bottom rubber needs to be cut so it overlaps the end of the float. Now an Avon float is easy to shop. They're usually just a bulk and one or may at the most two droppers. Now this one, when my cat decides to get off the table and play with the dog. Now this one is, says it's 2.4 grams or three double A's. So we're going to start off with three treble A's. Might have to work them a couple of times to loosen them off. Try and line the splits in the shot up so they hang on the line evenly. So there's the three bolt shots. We're going to drop it in the shotting tube to check it. Now looking at this, there's a little bit of the shoulder sticking out. So we can add some more shot. Now in deep water, fast running water, you want to be looking at probably the smallest would be a number four or a six, but usually a BB or something. So we're going to try a BB. Test for shotting. Very nearly there. It might require one more shot. So what we'll do is we'll try a number one and there we have it absolutely perfect just the tip of the red tip of the float showing so we have so we have the float three AAs and two smaller droppers and that's it you would just Either put one of the smaller shot up with a bulk and have it as a single dropper further down the line and uh, or you could you have if the current warrants it you could spread these bottom two smaller shots out to give you a bit finer presentation. Add your loop to tie hook length to and you're good to go but basically with floats like these it's a bulk and one or two droppers at the most. Do not try more than that. One dropper is usually all you need. But I have put two smaller shot to give you the option. And that is the uh, Avon float ready to go. Moving on to the loafer. Now this is got a much fatter top, stubby body shallow water float. Now with a loafer because the top is so fat you might struggle to find uh, a float rubber that's a good fit. Now I found the largest Drennan size 
can just be stretched over it. So, I've cut a couple of lengths, two different diameters. So we'll start off by threading the top float rubber on. Be warned, if you don't wet the top of this float, you'll never get the rubber over. I wet the top of the float, and it is a struggle. Finding large bore silicone is not easy, and because I don't use these floats a lot, my last lot had perished. But the largest will just stretch over to fit. To shot a loafer up, it's all about big shot. Now this one says it takes four and a half AA. So we're going to use swan shots, SSG. Two swan shot are roughly equivalent to four AAs. So we'll just attach the swans again, big, work them a couple of times till they're loose. Try and make sure the splits are lined up and then we'll just drop it in the float tube and check for shotting. Now we've got a little bit showing there so I'm going to add, I want it to go down to just the red tip showing so I'm going to try adding in that AA. Recheck the shotting. Now the addition of the extra AA has taken it down to just over the top of the float rubber. It possibly is a little too much, but I would start off with that and um, take it from there. If it proves to drag under because the water is too boily uh, or there's too much current, you can merely take the AA off and substitute it for a smaller shot. So I've just put a BB on and now we have a lot more of the float tip showing and I would guess that's probably about right. And that is basically the shotting for a loafer, just a big bulk of big shot. Sometimes you might want to move the BB down to act as a dropper but most of the time they are fished with a big bulk. And that's it, add your hook length loop or tie hook direct if you're going for big fish or whatever. And you're good to go. And that's the loafer. Thanks for watching. Bye for now. Catch you later.